Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. How do we understand what death is properly? First, ask yourself, what do you understand death to be? What is death to you? What is death to you? To a lot of people, they say, death, uh, I cannot have this fun life anymore. That is a death. Correct? Death means I cannot see my loved ones. That is death. Death is, the meaning is also endless. And understanding what death is, is what tariqats are concentrating. Because the Prophet says, die before you die. To die before you die. To die, to deny, to say la. <laughs> Again, how we can run away from la ilaha illallah. So to die before you die. One is leaving something. But the death, it is a doorway. The death is entering into a new life. So one you are leaving, and the other one you are welcoming. What is it that you are leaving? Do people want to leave? Majority don't want to leave. Majority hate death. Including Muslims. Muslims, can you imagine? Believers. Because to go through death is to meet Allah. Meaning that we hate to meet Allah. We prefer this life. So Prophet ﷺ says, die before you die. And tariqats are concentrating, what are the things that you need that needs to die? What are the things that needs to be left behind before you enter through this doorway? So if you're not concentrating on your ego to make that to die, your desires, to understand what is the shaitan and what is this dunya, for that to die, then you'll never understand that doorway to enter into that, the death into a real life, into a real understanding. This is not real life. This is not life. This is not life. This is an illusion of life. So, Our role model is the Holy Prophet The Sahabi Kiram And Allah, their inheritors Reminding mankind Of the reality of that life Beyond this illusion of life Once you start making a bridge to that life Then this life will become very sour to you This life will take on the meaning you will understand what Allah means when He says this is idleness, this is amusement, this is nothing. Because now you are starting to connect to that life. Our whole life as believers is in preparation for death. Preparing for it. We are keeping close the teachings of our Shaykh and the Holy Prophet wasalam, because for us to be away from them this is death a fake life to be with them that is life we're just spending our time trying to be good Preparing ourselves so that we may enter into their life. But to enter into their life, we have to cut away all the things that is holding us back from that real life in this fake life. At least the intention, at least to know I should not, I should not, I should not, I should not. That is real. Then it becomes pretty easy. Because To be separate, to be separated, that is death. 
air is not life. If you are separated and you are in the best uh, surroundings, but you're separated from that one that is giving you life, your beloved, that becomes a hell for you. May Allah not make us to be separate from our shaykh, inshaAllah. So I want to